A new feature in Raw Power 3 is the LUT adjustment. LUT stands for lookup table, which is a technical term for a large table of numbers that describes how to convert every possible color in an image. A lookup table can tint an image, make it black and white, or make very significant changes to an image's appearance. LUTs are very popular for two reasons. First, they make it really easy to apply a look to a set of images as is typically done in movies. Secondly, because a LUT is a single adjustment, it can be combined with a preset or other adjustments. Raw Power ships with a bunch of LUTs and it's possible to add additional ones. If you search the internet for LUTs, you can find a number of companies that provide LUTs for free or for purchase. I recommend the company LUTify.me, which has provided Raw Power with a number of expertly designed LUTs. The LUT adjustment in Raw Power is very easy to use. There are two initial categories, LUTs that you have imported and the built-in set. There are three categories of built-in LUTs. Creative, Film Simulations, and the above-mentioned LUTify.me LUTs. Film simulations are designed to be similar, but not identical to some analog films. Simulations can only include color, so they cannot contain grain or other effects like vignetting. To add a LUT, pick a category and pick a LUT. There's also an intensity slider that you can use to dial back the effect. We'll try some other LUTs so you can see the big effect LUTs can have on an image. Here are the film simulations. Black and white as well as different colored ones. And the ones from LUTify.me. To add your own, tap the Import button. A little bit of help comes up to tell you what's going to happen, which is mostly that it's going to bring up the Files browser. Raw Power supports the .cube format. You can choose the LUTs you want to import. Raw Power processes them, and now you can use them right away. Try them out. To manage the LUTs that you've installed, Tap the Show My LUTs button, which will bring up the Raw Power folder in Files, where you'll see a custom LUTs directory. And there they are, along with a cache file that Raw Power makes. And that's a quick look at LUTs. Thanks for watching.